Hey guys, today's video is going to be another first impression and today I'll be doing the Hourglass Opaque Rouge 12, uh, 14 Hour Wear Liquid Lipstick. This is the box it comes in and this is what it looks like. Um, this is the shade Muse. So if you saw my last haul video I believe, I featured this on there and this will be actually my first time wearing it. So I wanted to take you all as a little journey with me and if you saw my previous video my mac uh what is it moisture mineralized moisture foundation first impression you'll notice i have on the same clothes because i'm doing it on the same day so we're gonna knock out two birds with one stone <laughs> so anyway here's what it looks like comes in a tube like this and it has a doe foot applicator and I read very good reviews on this product, so let's see how it holds up. So right now I have nothing on my lips. I put on a lip balm earlier, but that was probably about 20 minutes ago, so that's all gone now. So I'm just going to apply right out of the tube. Wow, that's right. So here's what it looks like on and first off I can tell you I really really like this color it is very bold um, but I don't think it's so bold that people are gonna stare at me we shall see because I'm about to go like run some errands so <laughs> I'll let y'all know later people are staring at my lips but it's a bright uh, pinky coral it reminds me a lot of Mac Ablaze so if you weren't able to get your hands on that you might like this one um, if that's the shade that you like so I really do like it I only apply one layer and as you can see while I was applying it when I apply liquid lipsticks I like to put it on first and kind of get it mostly around my lips but then I take my finger to spread it out and I find that gives me a more of a stained look and that's what I prefer so um, yeah so far I really like it it went on very creamy kind of like the Sephora 12 hour or the Sephora liquid cream what is it called <laughs> Sephora cream lip stains that I like so it went on kind of like that um, maybe slightly thicker than those um, and then right now it's it's not completely dry yet I don't think but it has a slightly sticky consistency to it like it's like it hasn't dried down completely it doesn't really feel like a stain it feels like a liquid lipstick like uh, if you've ever used liquid lipstick you'll know what I'm talking about it's not uncomfortable at all but it is something that it doesn't feel like normal lipstick so if you're not used to it it's kind of something you have to get used to but I really like the color so far so wow this is I really really like this color so that's a plus so I'm gonna come back later on throughout the day and let you know how it holds up if it I know it's not gonna hold up for 14 hours and I don't plan on wearing it for 14 hours but I'll come back throughout the day and let you see how it holds up after a few hours or so so right now the time is let's see right now the time is 1 50 so I'll see you guys in a few hours okay I'm back and the time is now 5 25 it has been three and a half hours since I was last on and my lips are still looking decent the color is still there it still looks good um, there is some slight fading right in the middle of my lips probably because I was eating <laughs> um, but I was able to spread that out with my fingers and it covered it back up so I'm still happy with it so far um, between the last time I came I drank some coffee through a straw and some water through a bottle and I ate a couple of snacks and one of these snacks kind of got all on my lips but it wasn't like greasy food or anything it was like a pita chip so um, yeah it's, it's holding up pretty good in my opinion and I still love the color um, I think it's bright and bold but not shocking so anyway I will be back um, at the end of the day to let you know 
how it held up and see what it looks like at that point at this point right now i do not feel like it's drying my lips out or anything like that so see you soon okay so i'm back and it is now 9 9 p.m and so that means i've had this lipstick on for um about seven hours at this point a little bit of over seven hours so as you can see it is definitely faded a lot but in my opinion it faded pretty nicely i mean i ate chicken wings with this on i drank a few like drinks and coffee and that type of thing ate some snacks and only thing i will say is that i haven't talked that much today because i was off today so sometimes that can make your lipstick wear off as faster look um as well so i didn't talk that much but i did eat and drink and to me the lipstick held up pretty well it significantly faded but i still could walk around like this um and not be embarrassed i mean all i really need to do is maybe try to spread it out a little bit more evenly because it kind of wore a little bit more in the middle of my mouth or if I put a gloss on it it would be perfectly nice so I'm very impressed with this um, with this liquid lipstick by Hourglass again the shade is Muse and this is called the Hourglass Opaque Rouge Liquid Lipstick it's supposed to be 14 hour wear so judging on that I don't think it will last 14 hours but <laughs> Who wears lipstick for 14 hours anyway so i give this product a definite thumbs up and i really do like it it is rather expensive so i don't know if i would pay full price for it when i purchased it purchased it it was 15 percent off so i don't know if i would pay full price for another color but i really did like this shade so i decided to splurge on it um so if you have the funds to splurge and you like this color then I say go ahead and get it. I really, really like it so far. Did not dry my lips out. My lips do not look crusty. I didn't feel the need to apply lip balm on, so I'm happy. So I hope you all found this first impression video helpful. And I'm sorry if I've been kind of all over the place today <laughs> as far as what I've been saying. I just, I haven't been on camera in a while, so I'm trying to get back in the swing of things. So. I hope you all enjoyed it and I will see you in the next video. Bye.